Michigan running back Blake Corn left Saturday's game abruptly after suffering an apparent knee injury, but it appears he and team may have avoided the worst. Michigan head coach Jim Harbaugh said that Corey's knee did not sustain any serious damage and that the team is taking the injury as day to day. Nothing right now, Harbaugh said after the game regarding a detailed update. He, got cleared to go back in, and we'll see where it is tomorrow, how it's tough. Structurally good. Which is great news. Corin left the game late in the second quarter after taking contract to his left knee which resulted in his dropping to the turf in pain, grabbing the affected area. Trainers attended to Corin as he laid on the ground and though he was able to walk to the locker room under his own power, it was with a noticeable limb. X-rays taken during halftime were negative and Corin attempted to make a comeback in the second half performing with the team in warm-ups, but still limping as he attempted to make a cut, though he did take a carry on the second snap of the third quarter. Harbaugh said he finally pulled Corum from the contest as a precaution. I just thought it was bothering him, he said. So we said, okay, well, we know you won't keep going but, he communicated with us. How's it feel? And that's alright. We got CJ Stokes, we got Isaiah Gash, we got Tavi Dunlap. They'll step up. Next man up. Blake was coaching those guys and motivating them. It was good. That's the kind of team it is. Nobody panicked. Number 3 Michigan moved to 11-0 on the season with a come from behind win over Illinois and plays at Ohio State in the regular season finale next weekend. More college football from SI, Top 25 Rankings Rankings